Hello world, if you don't know me, I'm Ryan, and this is the first in a series of videos that I'm going to be titling Intro to Hacking with Hack the Box Academy. Now, the purpose of this series of videos is, of course, to introduce you to hacking using the Hack the Box Academy platform. We're going to be going over things like how to use Linux, Windows, get you familiar with the file system. We'll be going over web exploitation like file inclusion and directory fuzzing. We'll be going over Active Directory. We'll be hacking into things. We're going to be covering a lot of material using the Tier 0, the free Tier 0 modules in Academy to do so. And at the end, we'll be working on some starting point boxes on the main platform. Now, I have a disclosure that I want to make. Since the last time a video was uploaded to this channel, which was about a year ago, I was hired by Hack the Box. So at the time of the last upload on this channel, I did not work for Hack the Box, but shortly after that, I ended up being hired by them and I've worked for them for about a year. Full transparency on that. Don't want there to be any like conflict of interest or look like I'm hiding something. I do work for Hack the Box. Just want to get that out of the way right now. Now, this course will expect you to have no previous hacking skills at all. We're going to be starting from scratch. It does assume that you're tech savvy, that you have some computer knowledge, you know how to use a computer, you're a little bit familiar with some of the terms like HTTP and stuff like that, but it doesn't assume that you've ever done any hacking itself. We're going to be starting off from zero. We're going to work you up to a level where you're actually pretty fairly competent and you can work on things on the main platform, for example, and that's going to be the goal. So hopefully you guys will enjoy it. It's a project I've wanted to work on for a long time and I'm really excited to get started. Stay tuned for the next video where I'll be going over how to use the Kami platform itself. And then after that, we'll dive into our first module.